Bella's at Home Depot and she is asking me to lose a finger carefully. Da it's a it's a called a dowel. Dowel really blends out with this paint and this table. Yeah. And then she's going to add this. This is going to be the finished product project. Are they tricky to get off? Yeah. All right, Bella, how was that? Good, but I kind of got a paint on the eye. That's fine. It doesn't matter really, does it? Yeah, we can just do it this way, but I'm too scared it'll fall off. That's yeah. I'm holding it in the Keep it like that for now. Okay, let's see how we get out of this big old Home Depot. You could get lost in here. Mm-hmm. But if there's a Home Depot near you, you should definitely check it out, don't you think? Yeah. It's the first Saturday of every month, usually at 9 in the morning. And I'm always good to go. Yeah. Hey guys, it is storming out. I know you can't really see anything, oh, but... We just saw a streak of lightning across that street. Yeah, we just woke up. It is like, I don't know, midnight maybe? Oh! oh. Um, <laughs> this is kind of fun. And I don't know about you guys, but as long as you are safe inside your home, <gasps> storms are so fun to watch. Yeah, especially I like woke up in the middle of the night. I was like, oh, I just some around the window. And so I woke my mom up and then it was lightning. <gasps> yeah. Oh. Oh, gee. I just saw a streak of lightning. <laughs> I did too. Did you guys see that? I don't think they did. Do you guys like storms as much as we do? I mean, some dogs don't like it, but yeah. some people do. And dogs and cats and hexes. And whatever pet you have. <laughs> Kind of cool to watch this. It is hailing. And the tears are gonna like blow away for the bunnies. Do you see that? Yeah. Ooh, that is hailing bad. And I oh. hope that the windows are strong enough. The power almost went out. It did. So it's been storming, and as you saw, we've been recording it. Um, I'm trying not to shake right now, but somebody just came to our door and was like knocking, like knock, Can knock, 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 like wouldn't stop knocking. And so I yelled at them to go away. The cops have been called. Yeah, and I hadn't. I honestly, I hadn't even called them yet, but we just wanted to let them go because we really didn't want quite a cops and I'm wearing my sleep mask. Yeah, so now I'm waiting to see if the cops come and if whoever was there has gone away. It's kind of dark because I want to leave. Don't look. Get away! I can see you and I'm recording you! The cops are coming! What is wrong with you? I don't see them. So I don't know where the police are, but they're not here yet. And
Hey guys, all right, I wanted to come on here quick and just give you a quick update on what ended up happening tonight. So the cops have come and actually my brother and my friend ended up coming over as well. Right after the cops arrived, they showed up. Um, but it took a while for the cops to get here, I will say that, but the gentleman that was trying to get into my house, gentleman, I'm not calling him that, the the man that tried to get into my house, he um, was knocking on our door. He was... Like a creepy knock. <laughs> yeah. And then he was trying to open the doorknob. I don't know how much of this I had said before, what was recorded. Mm -hmm. um, it was scary. Mm -hmm. And I did go out there and I did actually talk to the guy. When the cops were here, he's yeah. not going out with that guy alone. No. Thank you for clarifying. Uh -huh. um, no. So I did go out there and he was highly intoxicated. He was cut and bleeding quite a bit. And I don't know. I asked him why he wouldn't leave. And he said, I don't know. That's what my mom told me. Yeah. I did not go out there. No, Bella was not allowed to go out there. So he said he, he didn't know why he wouldn't leave when I continually was screaming at the top of my lungs out my door for him to leave. He didn't have a reason why he wouldn't leave. So anyway, um, everything is okay now. He is in the, with the cops. Whatever they end up doing with them is what they end up doing with them. And, and hopefully he'll never, he'll never get out. Yeah. I did tell him. I said, now, uh, tomorrow is Sunday. and Or it's Sunday today. And since you're clearly not going to be able to go to church, I want you to at least say a prayer for Bella because... My daughter. Yeah, I said <laughs> say a prayer for my daughter because unfortunately for you, you can forget about this because you're intoxicated. But unfortunately for my kid, she's not going to forget about this Never. night. I'm going to this kid. To, I'm going to tell this story to my kids if I even have any. Oh, maybe okay. I don't know. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> so, but we're safe. Everything is fine. It was very scary. And I hope I don't have to go through that again. Hopefully. And anyway, just wanted to give you a quick update. Ooh, and I, I like that. We look great because <laughs> this is what you look like at 3 in the morning. Now I think it's closer to 4. Um, I'm scared. I'm, I'm still scared. What if another guy shows up? Nobody else is going to come here. And nobody can come in because we have the tightest locks. And our door is like, what is that made out of? It's made out of heavy metal. So, there's no way. No way. Nope, you're super safe. Unless he tries to get in from, like, the, um, the peak hole. He, like, would shoot something and then shoot another one in. Oh, yeah, they wouldn't want to do that. He didn't want to come in here and hurt us. He actually thought his friend lived here. How? He knows this is his place. And we clearly said, get out. He was... When you drink too much... It makes your mind not work right. And his mind wasn't working right. And then when the cops showed up, he said that, well, this is what we heard from inside. Um, what did he say? Oh, yes. I forgot. What did he say? He um, said, oh, yeah. Like, oh, this is the house. Never mind. <laughs> or, yeah. Or, or leaving or something. Yeah, he was like, oh, I'm just leaving. This isn't the right house. And he was, the cops were like, whoa, 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 or something. Yeah, yeah, they did. He said, you're not going anywhere. But, let me tell you, that was scary. We're fine. And now we're going to go to bed. Because we're tired. I'm not, I'm wide awake now. Yeah. All right, you guys, thanks so much for watching and listening to us. And If this was too scary for you, we are so sorry. We do never do stuff like this. No, so just be careful. There are people that are making bad choices in this world, and I want you to make good choices. So make good choices. And don't go to people's houses where you don't belong. Stay away from those houses. Go to your own house. Yeah, if they know who you are, you should at least warn them that you're coming. Exactly. Oh, That's a good point. If you do have friends, don't just show up at their houses either unannounced. Call them and let them know because maybe they need a vacuum quick. Yeah, because they, like, if... 
my dad was coming here to just like say hi, and he was like knocking like that. We would be saying that, and we, he would have gone to Sarah if he wasn't coming. Yeah, if he was coming, and Bella, he was supposed to come in two more days. Yeah, Bella thought maybe her dad had just come early, and I said it's not your dad. It sounded like him. Yeah. But it wasn't your daddy. No. I said your dad would have called. Because that your dad would have called or he would have texted. He would not have just shown up. And when we knocked, and when he knocked like that, he would have said, hey, Bella. Or hey, Amy. He always talks through the door, doesn't he? Yeah. And always. Like, I always forgot what I was saying. But that was freaky. Like, I thought I hold knocks, but see what believed me. Well, and we couldn't see him through the peephole because but, he was injured and sitting on the ground. Yeah, I, I saw him the very last minute. Yeah, she saw, like, his feet or something. Yeah, I saw him, like, sitting like this. Yeah. And, like, I don't know if you could guys see it like that, but a little big old. Mm-hmm. And he, he was, like, <laughs> he was, like, caught up in, the, like, a little ball, kind He's of. pretty injured. Yeah, there was, like, blood on the floor. There, yeah, there is. So, anyway, I don't want to make this too long for you guys, but... Thank you for watching. We will talk to you later. And hopefully this does never happen to you. Yeah. Have a really safe day. Yes. We love you guys. Bye. Bye. <laughs>